right, so today I have a problem with a, with a hive. Um, found out yesterday that there's no queen and they built two super seeder cells right next to each other, which means they work with bees. We're not happy with the old queen and obviously there's no queen in there, so we have to um, use an egg cell and use royal jelly and build a queen cell for that, so that way there'll be another queen here. So meanwhile, uh, with a weak hive, I'm going to need some sort of eggs and cat brood and larvae from another box. So thankfully Shane Howard, a friend of mine, gave me three frames that we put in a nook over here, this gray box. And I'm going to take three frames out of that that he gave me from his hive. And I'm going to put it in my hive. So there's a, again three different stages of brood in that nook that I'm going to utilize to keep my hive somewhat fairly strong or stationary. So I'm just going to go in into this hive, take some frames out, insert some of those, those three frames into this box, and just put it together. Okay. Oh my God. So there's, there's one frame of cat brood. There's some honey in the corners. Honey? Yeah, that's cat honey right in the corner, see? And there's the other side. Got some honey right over there. Yeah, that's cat honey. That's going to go in here. That is, what's, what's that black over there? What's the frame? Oh. Okay, just pay, pay attention here. And here's another frame. There's some cat brood. There's eggs in there from the queen from his, his hive. And there's another look. Just, you don't need to scroll like that one. Okay.
little bit on here. But it, it's like they're on trying to, to, to tell us Are you something. recording or not? What is that? Out of the box. Is one being there? Yep. You don't want to sit squash one, Dad. You almost squash one. Yeah. Gotta get the bees off the box, top box. Ooh. All right, I'm gonna just put the cover back on. And put the cover on, and that's it. See, now the three stages of between eggs, larvae, and the cat brood that will hatch. Uh, by the time the supersedure cells uh, hatch and the new two queens come out, and whichever one kills each other, the last one that goes out, by the time they go out, mate come back and start laying it'll be about 16 days and with, with what I put in for three frames of different phases of green larvae and eggs and cat brood that last six weeks so I've got enough time uh, for the queen to start laying and create a good healthy hive still and that's it <laughs>